Hello YouTubers. This video is a small demo on how to use expressions in Viger IX Developer to manipulate bits in tags. Please do not forget to like the video and subscribe to the channel. Viger IX Developer is a program to create visualizations for Viger Operator Panels or PC Runtime Systems. What is an expression? Expression is a sequence of variables and constants joined by operation signs. It is a combination of one or more constants, variables, functions, and operators that the programming language interprets and computes to produce another value. Expressions are often contrasted with statements. How it works in IX Developer Let's say I have some objects that color needs to be changed according to the status of the bits of some byte. For that reason I need 8 tags for each object. Let's create 8 bits starting at bit number 0 in byte number 50. The first tag is created, 7 more remains. All tags have been added, let's assign them to the fill dynamic of each object. As you can see, the color of the first object will change in accordance to the state of the tag B0. If the value is logical 0, then color of the object will be yellow. If the value is logical 1, then color of the object will be green. Repeat the steps for other objects, but different tags should be assigned. All is set. Compile and save the project. Let's test it to see how it works. So, as you can see, the color of all objects is yellow, it means, that all bits are false. Let's try to set bit number 0 to true. The color of the object changed to green. Let's try other bits and combinations.
colors of the objects change according to the state of corresponding bits. So, everything looks simple and clear, while there are several tags needed. But what if you need to handle 20, 30, 50, or more objects? You will be in need to create numerous counts of tags, your tag table will be huge. Here comes expressions in handy. Let's get back to the tag table of IX developer. Delete all 8 tags and create new one as of type byte. Now let's get to the fill dynamic of the first object. Select newly created tag. At the far right of the tag selection combo box there are three dots. Click on them and the expressions pop up will show up. You can load predefined expressions by clicking on load button, or you can create your own by clicking button new. I will create a new one. Give a name to your expression. Also, you can create a new group where your expressions will be stored. Write this expression for the bit number 0. How to understand this expression? You take the value of your tag, by using logical conjunction with value 1 in hex, you get a value of your first bit. More detailed explanation would look like that. Here is a binary expression of your tag. By the help of the conjunction the value of the bit number 0 is extracted. Next let's create expression for bit number 1. It would look like that. Again, for easier understanding let's look at the binary expression of your tag. This time I do extract bit number 1 from the tag and look for its value. To find out the value needed to extract a bit from tag a calculator can be used. Let's create expressions for other objects.
All is set, let's test the application. As you can see, application works well. By using expressions our tag table was reduced to one tag only. If you find this video helpful, please do not forget to like it and subscribe to the channel. Thank you for watching and happy coding.